सो हायर योर कैप्रिकॉन अ वेरी वेरी गुड इवनिंग टू यू गाइज दिस इज अंजलि टैरो एंड दिस इज अ जर्नल लव रीडिंग फॉर ऑल द कैपी सन मून विनस राइजिंग Keep in mind, this is general. It might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing, the roles can be reversed. Also, third thing, this is a reading from eight uh, till the fourteenth of April, and this is valid for every twelfth sign that you are dealing with along with your own sign. If it is not resonating, it's not your story. If you want to be a professional tarot card reader like me, you can start your journey by purchasing my course. The link is in the description box for the same. If you want to start your self healing journey through hope or no hope, no, but don't know from where to start and how to do that. I have created a master class it's a step by step process and you are going to learn to uh, how to heal every area of your life uh, yourself right so it's super easy super affordable and it's going to change your life and if you want to start your self love journey but don't know from where to start you can purchase my ebook it's super easy to understand okay and very affordable so let's start your person or your partner's current feelings for you right now at this present moment are we have the lovers okay there's lots of love in the situation there's lots of passion and attraction in the situation Okay, let's clarify the lovers. They might not be able to understand whether it's only love, whether it's lust or love. Okay, there there might be a confusion. There might be this fight over this energies of is it love? Is it lust? Is it something else? Is it just for the time being or what? Let's clarify the lovers. Yeah, I'm telling you. Uh, first of all, I see this person is seeing might be other people as well. uh they are keeping their options open for some reason i am getting that and they are very confused between you and the other options that they have and but from on your side like uh towards you this person is feeling a lot of love a lot of attraction a lot of pull and this person is not able to understand what the actual hack is happening right so this person is learning a lot of new energies new feelings that that, that they never felt this person never felt this kind of energies this kind of feelings for anybody and now when they are feeling this towards you this is kind of giving them a very strange sense of what the hell is happening yeah this person feels uh, like keeping the situation very light very casual but at the same time they are not able to do that so they are continuously trying to learn what the actual hack is happening are they in love with you are they are lusting over you uh, are they lusting over you are they in love with you uh is there something else uh, like uh, some kind of other energy that they are feeling towards you it's like is it temporary is it something that can be something more than more than this more than friendship kind of energy so this person is super confused they are trying to stay calm they are trying to make sense of what they are feeling towards you uh trying to entertain uh, entertain other energies but not able to get that kind of pull get that kind of sense of emotional happiness that they are getting from you my god it's very difficult to explain Let's see what do you feel about this particular person or situation from your side capies They are learning a lot from this connection capies this person is learning a lot of new things from this connection you feel a you feel you feel a soulmate kind of dynamic you feel like this person or this energy completes you in some way shape or form strange let's clarify the two of cups We have the Eight of Swords, the World card, and the Six of Pentacles. You are uh, you feel like uh, the overthinking is gone, and you're quite sure this this could be the person that you can have a very beautiful connection with in the coming future. And you're kind of trying to balance your acts, like balance the situation. You feel like giving having equal give and take of energy in the situation because you are feeling some kind of feelings towards this particular person and situation, and you feel like you should stop overthinking about the situation and give it a shot. give it a chance right because uh, the more you are going to overthink about it the more you are going to create unnecessary uh, conflict in the situation so it's better to put an end to this overthinking portion and start giving in this direction in this situation and do something good in the situation give good energies send good energies in that on their way so that they can send you uh, send you good energies back okay wow this is good you're you're thinking about it a lot and the more you are thinking about it the more it's making sense to you like yeah this is something that 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 i can work on this is something beautiful okay let's see what this person wants from you what are their intentions for the situation between you and them capies okay come on honey it's okay i'm sorry i love you let's see let's see okay let's see what uh, what uh, this person wants from you what are their intentions 
we have the eight of wands their intention is to talk to you their intention is to get to know more and more and more about you the, the more they can get out of you the more they are going to be like yeah okay i got it okay they definitely want to have a lot of uh, back and forth communication lot of meetings if not if possibly not meeting uh, like uh, at least connecting with you via video call or something to have face to face interactions mm -hmm. yes this person wants to cut the crap this person wants to you know they don't want to let you know that they are so confused and they are so much in their head about things so that is why this person wants to talk to you a lot you know get to know about you a lot and understand you a lot so that they can understand what the actual heck is going on because this person is definitely not able to understand what they are feeling and why they are feeling what they are feeling they are just confused because they have never felt this way before towards anyone and it's kind of strange for them it's kind of new for them so they they do want to get to know about you each and like get to know about each and everything about you right yeah they are they're super confused they're not able to understand what the heck is going on they're not able to see the clear picture of anything here but they do want to talk to you like no tomorrow so that they can understand if this is love or lust or something else or if this is just a temporary thing or whatever mm -mm. basically this person wants to let go of the confusion and they don't want to they don't want you to sense it that they are super confused and they don't know what the hell is going on inside of them Let's see what do you want from this particular person or situation from your side, Capis. What is happening? Knight of Swords. Okay. Oh God. Let me clarify this Knight of Swords before saying anything, because it's giving me mixed signals. We have the Nine of Pentacles, the Two of Cups, and the Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, it's like I want my days of being single to be over. I want to go in this direction and create something stable in this situation because I do feel love, Anjali. I do feel a soulmate kind of dynamic. I do see a potential in this situation. So I don't want to be single from this situation. But at the same time, I don't want to be fully committed to the situation. But I do want this connection and stability on the table for me because this feels good. It's scaring the shit out of you that this person might take your singlehood or this person might take your independence. It's scaring the shit out of you, but you want to jump into this connection. You want to take the risk because you are like, okay. I want to do that. I don't want to lose myself into this, but I want to go in this direction and create something solid, stable for the situation. But I hope you are able to understand the dilemma here. You want to be in the connection, you want to take the risk, but you don't want to lose the sense of your independence. But at the same time, you do. Okay, honey, got it. And it's taking a lot of courage and strength to even acknowledge. that you are falling in love with this person or you are able to see the potential in this situation that is taking a lot of courage and strength from your side capricorn but you are facing it and acknowledging that is a very good thing okay let's see what's coming towards it till the 14th of april capis judgment okay judgment is there so might be this is a situation that was over at some point of time and it's uh, coming back over or let's see let's clarify the judgment before saying anything more mm -mm. we have the 7 of pentacles the 10 of wands and the 9 of pentacles i do see improvement in this situation I do see finally you guys are going to drop the stressful energies of okay we are going to lose our independence and both of you are going to be slowly but surely heading towards this let's start and let's see where it goes right this kind of thing slowly but surely this situation is heading towards something meaningful because both of you are going to uh, let go of the stressful energy of uh we are going to lose our independence we are going to lose something that we were making from a very long time or the said that the fear of losing your independence the fear of losing yourself in the situation is going to be uh vanished or both of you are going to just uh, think about uh creating something beautiful out of this it's like okay 
okay i accept that i have feelings and you are also going to accept that you have feelings and you are going to start something from scratch with this energy of let's see where it goes planting the seeds of a new connection planting a seed of a re like relationship and watching it flourish this is going to be the outcome slowly but surely something meaningful is going to come out of the situation the only problem here i uh, that i see here is that you have a fear that you're going to lose your independence or you're going to lose yourself in the situation from time to time this kind of energy can pop up that can be a hurdle or that can be a issue but otherwise i do see a beautiful connection starting from scratch and becoming something very beautiful in the coming future if you are going to water it properly if you're going to give it proper energy and time something beautiful can come out of this because it's actually very beautiful right the universe also wants me to tell you that if you want actual growth and happiness in a, in a particular direction give it some time okay work on it okay give your time and effort and energy in the situation without any kind of expectation just wait and watch just go with the flow and see where things are heading okay if you are going to have a like a very very high expectation from the situation that it could convert it, it should convert into marriage or commitment or something like that only then you might end up being disappointed might might be might be right not 100 percent but if you're going to just enjoy the journey enjoy the process and see where things can go in this particular direction i do see you are going to have a you are going to have beautiful moments of sharing good energy good kind of vibes with somebody and having a lot of fun along the way and understanding your own energies and letting go of the fears that you're having from a very long time so just go with the flow have fun with the energies don't have uh, any expectations of you know having something solid on the table as of now it might come along the way if it is meant to but just enjoy the process enjoy the journey and just go with the flow and see good things coming your way right yeah this is how you manifest actually so yeah thank you so much for tuning in cappies i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste